Uh, greetings everyone. In this video, we'll be looking at uh, NCA Level 1 uh, Mathematics Common Assessment Task on Algebra. Uh, some of the skills that will be demonstrated in this video will be identifying uh, keywords and phrases and using these to write uh, algebraic um, expressions. So this table contains some of the keywords and phrases that are common in the assessment. So I'd suggest um, if you could pause the video and take note of these. So each of the four operations, addition, subtraction, multiplication and division, has got uh, keywords that go with that and uh, also the equal sign. So if you're reading a problem in context, you will need to decipher the information and uh, uh, use uh, mathematical uh, operations to form uh, algebraic expressions equations so in this case i've got this uh, list there please uh, feel free to uh, pause the video and uh, take note of this so we'll look at some of the examples uh, using those um, keywords uh, and translating them uh, into algebraic expressions so first example uh, three more than a number so in this case a number is unknown so we can take any variable any letter to denote that number so in this case i have chosen uh, letter n so three more than a number in this case will mean n plus three. Second one the quotient of uh, a number n eight so, uh, quotient means divided by you can use um, a over eight or any other letter that will still be correct. So in this case it will be um, any letter divided by eight so I've chosen y divided by eight. Uh, six times a number so let's say a number is n so it will be six n. Uh, 15 less than a number so if I say a number is n and uh, I've got to go 15 less than that number so it's n take away 15 uh, 4 more than a number s so in this case we are told that the number is s and we want uh, 4 more than that number so it's s plus 4 uh, the product of 7 and c uh, product means times so it's 7 times c which is 7c next one uh, 9 less than twice a number x so in this case a number is denoted by variable x so it says twice a number so 2x and then uh, 9 less than uh, twice a number means 2x take away 9 uh, next one uh, twice the sum of uh, three numbers so in this case um, we've got sum of three numbers sum means uh, total so the three numbers let's say are x y and z so if I find the sum of those three numbers, that becomes x plus y plus z. And then it says twice the sum of those uh, numbers. So the result is doubled in this case. So you must use bracket to denote that the whole thing is uh, doubled. So twice means two times uh, the sum of x plus y plus z. Uh, next one, the plumber added an extra $35 to her bill. We don't know what the actual bill was before uh, addition of extra $35. So we can say that the original bill was X dollars. So it will be X plus another 35. So X plus $35. Uh, last one here, it says 35 fewer people came uh, than the number expected. So we didn't know the actual uh, expected number in this case. So we can denote that with um, any uh, letter. So let's say N and it says uh, 35 fewer people came. So it's N take away. 35 so the expected number take away 35 i uh, hope this makes sense i would suggest if you could uh, pause the video and take note of the um, uh, keywords and phrases and try and practice um, uh, these types of questions uh, thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next video